Hey everybody, Daniel Rubino here with WP Central, and I want to give you a quick look at a new app that just came out today called Goo News by Sean Wildermuth, who's pretty big in the developer community. He actually writes a lot on these topics, and he's someone probably worth following too on Twitter as well as blog. Anyways, uh, Goo News is what it sounds like. It's a Google News aggregator, and it's a smooth little free app that just came out, and we really kind of dig it actually. We'll watch it here. First thing you'll notice, it launches very quickly. It's a very fast app. And for that reason alone, it's really nice to use. Here you go, you have your top news, and you scroll across, you have US News, Health, Entertainment, Windows Phone 7. That's because I added my own feed. That's probably one of the coolest features of this. And then you scroll down, you have all your top stories, a little refresh button down here. Now those categories are customizable by going to Settings. And here you go, here are your different categories that could just be toggled on and off. Go across here to search, and you can add your favorite uh, feed just by adding keywords to it. And let's see over here, uh, your instant paper uh, account, if you use that, that's uh, highly recommended for people if you use that service, which is a service that allows you to basically save your Google News stories for later offline. And there are a couple apps that do that actually. And yeah, so that's basically it for settings. Pretty basic, very easy to use. And then you can just find an article you want to look at, click it. Now, it is a front end for Mobile Internet Explorer, so it's still going to load the article up in IE. And of course, that can take a little while depending on the site. It's not the mobile version. But, you know, that's something, you know, Sean can do anything about. Still, you can see here, it loads the article up. And then you can just use your normal, normal uh, you know, taps everything you have your options here you can just go to Internet Explorer to view the site there share via email and of course add the article to Instapaper for later savings and perusal and that's basically it um, what can I say there's not much else to the app it works very well it's fast it's got a nice interface and it's free so if you're a big Google News user or you like to use custom feeds highly recommend you give it a spin there you go take care everybody